Namaste to all. Welcome to Lively Home Style. Kids love noodles and momos. Why only kids? Even we love them, right? But we are concerned consuming refined flour or maida. Here I'm sharing how I made homemade wheat noodles and momos that are both nutritious and satisfying. To start, we'll make the wheat noodle dough. Here I've used egg for kneading the dough. If you are a vegetarian, then skip the egg and add little oil to the flour and then knead it by adding water. Once you get a soft pliable dough, smear some oil and let it rest for some time. Meanwhile, let's prep the veggies. Now roll the dough as thin as possible. Be generous with the dry flour to avoid sticking. Then cut it into thin strips to make noodles. Meanwhile keep the water for boiling. Add little salt and oil to the water. When the water starts boiling add the noodles and cook for 3 to 5 minutes. Once it's done, strain it, mix little oil and set aside. Meanwhile, in a kadai, take oil, add garlic, green chilli, sliced onion and saute. Now add veggies of your choice and saute. Add salt, pepper powder, soy sauce and mix. You can add spices of your choice to make noodles as per your liking. Now add cooked noodles and mix well. Add vinegar, mix well and turn off the flame. Garnish it with coriander leaves. Time to enjoy the noodles. You can use a chakli mold to make the noodles as well. Sometimes when my daughter is bored with regular dinner, I just make these noodles and serve it with the curry of the day. And she really enjoys it. Now let's move on to the next recipe, healthy momos. Here I'm using rava or semolina instead of refined flour for making the dough. Along with momos, let's make a spicy momos chutney. For chutney, soaking the badgi red chilies in hot water. If you like more spicy, then you can add few guntu chilies to this. Place the tomatoes in boiling water for few minutes to soften. Now in a bowl, take semolina, add little oil, salt and knead it by adding water to a soft dough. Let it rest for 20 to 30 minutes. Now for the stuffing in a kadai, take oil, add garlic, chopped onion and saute. 
add grated carrot, finely chopped capsicum and cabbage and saute. Cover till it softens a bit. Add pepper powder, salt, soy sauce and mix. Stuffing is ready, turn off the flame. Now let's prepare the chutney. In a mixi jar take boiled tomato, garlic, soaked red chilies and grind to a coarse to fine paste. Now in a pan take oil, add the ground paste and cook till oil separates. Add salt, vinegar and mix. Chutney is ready. Now once again knead the dough gently. Take tiny balls and flatten it thinly. Place the stuffing in the center and fold it in your desired shape. This is the easiest way I felt. Now steam cook the momos for 10 minutes. Enjoy momos with spicy chutney. So that's all for this video, hope you liked the video, thank you for watching and don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more such videos or recipes in the future. Stay safe and take care.